You ready to fight? You ready? Good. Well, it's a venue that needs no introduction. The world's most famous arena, Madison Square Garden. Even for a Boston guy, I have levels of appreciation for the building. I mean, when you walk into MSG, you get chills because you understand the history that comes with competing in this arena. Looking to establish the jab here. Nicely done by Moicano. Push kick there to the body. Straight punch lands. And they clinch now. Oh, big knee landed by him there. Perhaps that'll give the jiu-jitsu practitioner a little pause working his way inside. Yeah, he does a good job of throwing things up the middle. If you throw knees, it really does make the grappler reconsider level changing because he's afraid to run into something like that that could end his night. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Takedown defense holds up. So one minute into this fight, and as many people expected, the action absolutely crazy. Back and forth. This is a full-on brawl, DC. It's hard to watch a fight like this and call a fight like this because you never know when somebody's going to take that one shot that finishes the fight. All right, we go to the clinch right now where this BJJ fighter has been pretty good at finding a way to get the fight to the ground. We'll see if he can do it here. He gets the fight to the ground mainly from the clinch. This is exactly where he needs to be. He got chest to chest, and now he's going to try to impose himself on his opponent to start to really wear at, that, wear at the cardio. All right, doing work with the jab. Back and forth we go. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Oh, no pad on the foot. That's a solid kick right there. All right, so a good job by him here. He continues to block these shots. Seems to see them coming a mile away. He sees them coming a mile away, and he's blocking, he's rolling, he's slipping. He's doing a great job. Oh, and he caught the kick. Beautiful body kick. Oh, he missed with that right hand. That's a beautiful body kick. Beautiful combination there. If you are teaching an up and... Flips that left hand. Well, he rocked him, but couldn't finish it. He rocked him, he hurt him bad. He couldn't find that one shot to close the door. Could not shut the lights off. And now, pass the to find that shot again. Clipped him with the right hand there. All right, so now blood is a factor. You see that he has been opened up in that eye area. Yeah, he's got hit in the eye, and now there's a cut. But there's nothing to worry about too much now. He's got to be very careful with it as we go forward. Beautiful shot lands to the leg there. All right, gets inside, gets the single collar tie here. All right, so look at that. A cut has been opened around that eye area. He's taking shots over and over again to that area, and now he's dealing with a cut. Back to the stand-up now. Both fighters upright. Fighter blocks the punch. Oh, that's a beautiful land downstairs with the kick. Hook to the head there by Moicano. All right, well, if you like blood, perhaps this is the fight for you. That cut is really starting to open up wide now. It's starting to open up, but it doesn't seem to be affecting him too bad right now. It's still bloody, but it's not really limiting his, his, his ability to continue. Let's see if he can get through this and win this fight. Oh, you land, I land. Is that what we're doing here? Heavy kick downstairs. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Oh, and that kick is blocked. Got the single pilot time. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder rounds. 
Time. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, so the round is over, but not before damage was done. Cut on the cheek, sustained in that round. Cut man in there quickly as usual to try to seal it up. What I need you to come in right now, and you use your footwork. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. You ready? You ready? Let's Here go. we are, early round two. All right, next round is now underway. Hopefully the action continues at a high level. Pretty good first five minutes. Pretty good first five minutes. Both of them can really pick it up. Let's see who decides they're going to lead the dance as we go forward. Beautiful job getting those hands up. Another strike hits that eye area, and it is getting messier by the minute up there. Well, he's getting targeted now. He's been hitting that spot so many times that his opponent sees the cut, and the cut is advancing. Some damage being doled out, and now some swelling upstairs on his opponent. He's not moving his head effectively. He's trying to be face first. Look, you don't have to prove how tough you are. You've got to move your head, be active. Don't be reactive in your defenses. Glancing right hand lands upstairs. Nice crack there. Trying to land the elbow there to no avail. Well, not exactly what we thought we would see out of this jiu-jitsu fighter. He's had a lot of success on the feet, and I think this is why sometimes the film can lie if you lean too heavily in. Absolutely. I mean, you think you're coming in here to fight a grappler, and this guy looks like a boxer tonight. His hands have looked crispy. His kicks, everything that he is doing has worked. And I think this is partly due to the fact that you think he's trying to take you down, when in reality, this guy can fight everywhere. Man, he ate another shot right on that cut. You think he's good? Oh, he's hurt. So how about that? What a moment for this fighter as he pounds him out for the TKO win. Relentless strikes landed across the board and a huge, huge win in his career. John, that was so impressive. What an amazing display of finishing ability by this young fighter. All right, let's get it to Bruce Buffer. He has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 47 seconds of round number two. Declared the winner by knockout, Benoit!